I'm going to make the opening to Pocahontas made by DreamWorks from 1987, real, not fake. I made the opening, and now let's upload this to YouTube. Digit, what are you doing? I made the opening to Pocahontas made by DreamWorks from 1987, real, not fake. Let me see. Oh 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 digit. The opening is strongly fake. Pocahontas was made by Disney and came out in 1995. You are grounded, 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 grounded. Go to bed and sleep forever. Wow. Inez, you are grounded, 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 grounded for one hundred billion trillion years. Go to bed now. No, 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 Yay 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 yes 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 man i always wanted a pet but i never got the chance because poopy mac usopper always grounds me for no freaking reason but i know i'm going to pet cook to get a pet duck Welcome to Petco. I'd like to have the duck that's right behind you. Here you go. <coughs> what should I name you? Well, because you're not an ordinary duck, and you look like Macasoper. I think I'll name you Quackusopper. You're a good duck. Diesel Busters, get down here right now. <coughs> Diesel Busters, why is there a duck in the house? Um, 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 I got this duck from Petco because I wanted a pet duck, and I named him Quackasoper. Diesel poopy 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 bastards. How dare you get a pet duck and name him Quack a Super? That's it. You're grounded, 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 grounded for eight zero 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 years. Go back upstairs to your room now. Babe, today we're meeting my friends Emma, Nia, and Gate here at the park and going to my house to play some board games. How does that sound? That sounds awesome. Arthur. Would you like to join us? Sure. But I'm waiting for Peppa, and then she and I can arrive a few minutes later. Alright, sounds good. By the way, my friends are visiting from Mexico, Arthur and Buster, I know you'll like them. Hey girls, I'd like you to meet my boyfriend, Buster. I'm Emma. 
I'm Kate. And I am Maija. Nice to meet you. Nice to meet you, Buster. And great to meet you, Buster. Likewise, Ma, Kate, and Mia. We're all going to have fun playing some board games. Let's go to my house. Arthur is waiting for Peppa so he'll join us later. By the way, Arthur is standing next to Buster. Arthur, I'd like you to meet Emil, Maya, and Kate. Hey Arthur. Hi Arthur. Hey Arthur. Hey Emma, Maya, and Kate. It's good to meet you. Likewise. Good game, you all. Oh, and here comes Arthur and Peppa. Hey Arthur, good to see you and Peppa were able to come. Would you like to play billiard with us? Absolutely. Me too. I wonder what's on TV. Hi kids, I'm Arthur. Today let's do something I've never done before on the show. I'll teach you all how to make fake VHS openings. But wait, here comes a special guest who is an expert at it. His name is Warren Cook. Warren, before you come on the show, we're both going to teach you kids how to make the opening to Tarzan from 1957, real, not fake. It'll be your first fake VHS opening. Oh my god. I can't stand Arthur anymore. His show has severely deteriorated no wonder Matt the Go Animator makes grounded videos out of him. I'm going to ground him myself. Also, Tarzan was made in 1999. Oh my freaking 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 god. Arthur, how dare you make a fake VHS opening on live television. Tarzan came out in 1999. That's it, you are grounded for 800 billion years. Go to your room now. Yay, I grounded the troublemaker Arthur Reed. Keelan, I am so proud of you for grounding Arthur. You are ungrounded for eternity. Arthur was a big time troublemaker recently. And we can both give credit to Matt the Go Animator for rewriting the episodes and making every episode have Arthur getting grounded. I'm going to scare DW while she's sleeping. Ha 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 Arthur, how dare you scare your sister DW while she's sleeping? That's it. You're grounded, 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 grounded. Go to bed now. I'm feeling really bored today. I wonder what to do. I know, I'm going to watch Gone Girl. It's supposed to be a really good movie.
Wow, that was the best movie I ever saw in my whole entire natural born life. I have to watch it again. Arthur, what are you doing? Um, nothing, just watching, eh, really, great episode of Bionic Bunny. It's the best episode I ever saw. Wait a minute, that doesn't look like Bionic Bunny, so let me see. Oh 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 Arthur, how dare you watch Gone Girl? That movie is rated R, and you're only eight years old. That's it. You're grounded, 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 grounded for one hundred trillion quadrillion decillion years. Go upstairs to bed right now. Rosie, today we're going to United Artist Theaters to see Finding Dory because Caillou wanted to see it. But Dad, I don't want to go to United Artist Theaters to see Finding Dory. I want to stay home and see Peppa Pig. Rosie, you're coming with us to United Artist Theaters to see Finding Dory, and that's final. Now come along with us or you'll be grounded big 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 time. But Dad, I don't want to go. Rosie, we're going to the premiere, so shut the fuck up and get used to it. Can we go to Peter Piper Pizza? No. We're not going to Peter Piper Pizza. You can get something to eat once we get to the theater. Well then, can we go to Dave and Buster's? Because I am really 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 hungry. Absolutely not, we are going straight to United Artist Theaters. Now shut your mouth and no more excuses or you will make us late. Oh crap, we missed the premiere. Thanks a lot Rosie for your most stupidest, lamest excuses, we'll have to wait until tomorrow at least. What? Shut the hell up Rosie, this was entirely your fault. Stop crying like your bisexual dumbass gay sister Daisy. But mom, dad, Caillou. No bots. You knew that if you didn't come with us to see the premiere of Finding Dory, that you would be in dead meat. And look what you did. You made us miss the premiere. And not only that, you made us wait at least another day to even see the film. But mom and dad, I didn't want to see Finding Poopy Dory. I wanted to stay home and watch Peppa Pig, but I never got a chance to. So that's why I had to make you run late. No, the reason you had to come with us was because your big brother Caillou wanted to see Finding Dory. I'm very 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 sorry. Your apologies are not accepted. When we arrived at the theater, there was an applause after the end credits, and people were already leaving the theater. Oh I get it. I am really, 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 really. Really, 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 sorry. Can we at least go see the premiere of The Secret Life of Pets tomorrow? No. You are grounded, 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 grounded. When we get home, you will immediately march to your room. Go upstairs to your room right now and never ever 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 come out. And stop crying like a baby. Rosie, Daisy, and Caillou, your dad and I are going out to a special dinner tonight as today is our anniversary. We're getting you a babysitter to watch after you guys. Who is it going to be? It's not the usual babysitter you guys always have. Today, Julie will be babysitting. She is 15 years old. But Dad, I don't like Julie. Oh come on Kalu, you've never met her before. And I think you'll like her. Okay, but she better take us to Chuck E. Cheese's or something. Kalo, first of all, 
Because she's 15 years old, she's not old enough to drive, so she can't take you guys to Chuck E. Cheese's, and second of all, you go there too much I think. Okay, but she better be fun and entertaining. She is a very entertaining girl, and she has a lot of fun things for you guys to do. Yeah 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 yeah. That should be awesome. Okay. That must be Julie. Hi Rosie. Hi Daisy. I'm Julie. No, I don't want any supper. I don't want any supper. I want, Rosie, you have to eat your supper. You can't make me. I have an idea, why don't do something special? Remember, your mommy and daddy were going to a special dinner. Let's go to Chuck E. Cheese's. Let's go to Chuck E. Cheese's. I'm sorry, but mommy and daddy said to me that I can't take you guys to Chuck E. Cheese's. Plus, I am not old enough to drive. Come on. I don't want spaghetti. I want Chuck E. Cheese's. Come on. I don't want spaghetti. I want Chuck E. Cheese's. Rosie, you can go to Chuck E. Cheese's another day. But right now, you need to eat your spaghetti, you too, Daisy. No, I don't want my freaking spaghetti, and that's final. Take me to Chuck E. Cheese's right now, Blondie. Sit right back down this instant, Rosie. Screw this. Oh 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 Rosie, how dare you throw down the dinner table? That's it, you'll get a huge surprise punishment from mommy and daddy. Boris and Doris, you won't believe what your daughter Rosie did while you were gone. What did she do? She begged me to take her to Chuck E. Cheese's, but I told her no. But then she threw the dinner table and shattered the plates of spaghetti. Daisy, we have some punishments for you after Julie leaves. Daisy, I mean Rosie, I can't believe you disrespected your babysitter Julie. That's it, you're grounded for three weeks. This means no Chuck E. Cheese's. And no Peter Pipe Pizza. Go to bed right now. Alright everyone, today we are all going to see the premiere of Four Nights at Chuck E. Cheese's since Caillou wanted to see it, and he has been very well behaved this past month. Yay, Daisy want to see the Chuck E. Cheese movie. And so does Rosie. Rosie is excited to see the new Chuck E. Cheese movie. Like I says, we're all going to see the movie. And it starts in a couple of hours, so we need to be at the movie theater like 15 or 20 minutes before so we can get a good seat. And Rosie, and especially Daisy, I expect that you will bung your absolute best behavior, especially when we're at the theater and watching the film. Understood? I understand, Dad. And Daisy understand. Okay. Good. And we will also buy popcorn for the entire family to have during the movie. But your kids better promise not to fight over the popcorn, okay? We won't fight over the popcorn, Mom and Dad. That's my kids. And I think we're all going to have a wonderful time at the Chuck E. Cheese movie. Daisy, aren't you excited to see the premiere of the new Chuck E. Cheese movie? I know I am. Yes, Daisy is ready for the Chuck E. Cheese movie, and Daisy is also ready for some popcorn. We're all ready for the premiere of T. Chuck E. Cheese movie, Daisy. And so is Caillou but remember kids, you must share the popcorn for everybody to have. And the film is going to start in a minute, so I think it's a good time that must keep our voices down so that other people can enjoy the movie. Ladies and gentlemen, our feature presentation is about to begin. So will you please turn off your cell phones, keep your conversation still, and enjoy the film. Thank you.
Daisy, can you not eat so much popcorn? You need to save some for the rest of the family. No, Daisy love her popcorn. Daisy will not share with big sister Rosie. Daisy and Rosie, could you please keep your voices down? People are trying to watch the movie. But Daisy is not sharing the popcorn with everyone. She's hogging it all to herself. Daisy, I said before that you need to share the popcorn with everyone. And both of you are disrupting the movie. Look how everyone is now staring at us. Well, if you guys want your fusing popcorn, then go get it. I don't give a flying shit if it flies all over the floor. You stupid baby, how dare you spill our fucking popcorn? Ow 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 This is what it comes to hitting me. You're so fucking stupid. Rosie, Daisy, how dare you fight in the middle of the movie? You are so 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 in big trouble. Let's go home before security kicks us out. Rosie and Daisy, I can't believe you two were fighting over the popcorn during the movie and disrupted everyone watching and made a mess all over the theater by spilling the popcorn. You two are grounded 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 for infinity years. No more movie theaters for you until you can behave and learn to share the popcorn. Now go upstairs to your rooms. <laughs>